So right now we are going to do a functional test with a smoke detector. We installed uh, inside the ceiling. I'm now with uh, Mr. Lito and Rene, uh, my colleague in uh, this project. Mr. Lito uh, holding a smoke tester, which he have to spray it inside with the smoke detector. Uh, as you can see now, uh, Mr. Lito is spraying the smoke tester, the smoke detector inside the ceiling and now we are waiting for the response of the detector. And uh, as you can see uh, above in front of uh, Mr. Lito, we have here the alarm indicator which is uh, connected with the smoke detector inside the ceiling you can see now the led is blinking so it uh, sends smoke so now we are going to be back at the main panel fire alarm panel so as you can see also here uh, the panel is blinking and there is some uh, notification of the detector So after the notification and some alarm at the panel, we have to wait for uh, two minutes as it was a program uh, within two minutes the notification devices will be alarmed and uh, triggered with the fault that we make at the smoke detector inside the ceiling. As you can see now the end here that the notification or the strobe light is uh, already alarmed within two minutes uh, this uh, only within the loop and uh, of course after all the clearing and checking uh, we need to acknowledge and reset the panel if all the uh, all the fault already done and uh, check the area so now we are going to test again another uh, loop this is uh, for the loop one we are going to test the call station manual call point sorry manual call point so as you can see here the manual call point already blinking and now in the panel you can see the address and uh, the device name and the location of the call point that we have triggered so wait until two minutes and we can see the alarm the strobe light will be on and the bell will be on For the manual call point, uh, you can see here the yellow at the top uh, side top. This is indication of uh, someone uh, push the call point. So right now, as you can see it with the panel, uh, you cannot see the battery backup battery as is uh, we we are not yet uh, installed it in the. Uh, we are focusing first in the testing for the loop and some devices so uh, after we are going to install it also
again uh, we need to uh, acknowledge the the alarm and reset the panel so also we need to reinstall this uh, call point one more call point so that uh, there will be no fault at the panel and that will be the end of my video guys so thank you for watching and hope you learned something from me and and please like and subscribe my youtube channel thank you